Hello, everyone. I'm here with Franz Anala, Sales and Marketing Manager from Controlled Reality. Uh, would you like to tell us a little bit more about yourself? Yes, uh, uh, I'm Franz Anala, and like Peter said, I'm the Sales and Marketing Manager of Control Reality. Um, I've been working here or at Control Reality for two years and been loving it so far. That is nice. Can you tell us something fun about yourself? Something fun. What could that be? Well, I'm actually I'm unbeaten in VR table tennis. So if someone wants to challenge me, I'm up for it. Maybe I'll take you up on that later. Yeah. Uh, so how has your journey with XR looked like? How did you get started and gotten where you are now? Yeah, well, actually, two years ago, I, I noticed that Contra Reality was looking for an export manager. And as an international business student back then, I, I was really interested and I've always been really interested in, in new technologies and in XR techno technologies. So uh, I, I decided to apply and uh, I got in, I <laughs> got the job. But unfortunately, because of COVID, we haven't had uh, a lot of success internationally. But hopefully, in the near future, that will change. But um, in the meantime, I, I, I've been doing a lot of uh, sales and marketing here in Finland, and uh, that's been great as well. Where are we right now? Can you tell us a bit about the space? Yeah, this is actually a lobby space from our Contour Elements uh, software. Uh, the software is meant for design and meeting purposes. And um, it's, I think it suits pretty well for these purposes as well, because we're here having an interview, having a meeting. So it's a really nice setting. It's not visually the most beautiful place, but I think it, it will do the job. I have like different elements here. Last, last year, when we were a partner for Match XR, uh, we decided to put some elements that, that, that represent our solutions. Like we have some AR stuff right over there and some VR stuff right over there. So some, some nice, unique uh, pieces that are worth, worth visiting if you visit our world. Yep, everyone should come visit here and see yeah. what they have to offer around the space. Yeah. Uh, can you tell us more about your company? Contra Reality makes world-class virtual reality and augmented reality solutions. Uh, we mainly focus on we VR training solutions uh, for for companies who who need a training software. And AR is mainly for marketing purposes. So if you want to take your marketing to the next level, we can definitely help you with that. So AR and VR. We are training mainly, and AR is for marketing purposes mainly. Uh, yeah, and again, uh, is there anything fun you would be able to tell us about your company? The funny story, I think it's a pretty <laughs> funny story. Um, two Christmases ago, pre-COVID, uh, when we had our Christmas party at the office, uh, our staff decided to code, uh, code a zombie VR video game like out of nowhere, they just started to started to make the game, and uh, they used as a they used hula hoop as a controller. So I, I thought it was pretty fun that you you could kill zombies with a hula hoop <laughs> uh, spinning around your <laughs> hip. So that was pretty fun, and I, I think we're as a company we're pretty fun as well, and I'm willing to try and do anything that's that the client wants. Yep, VR has endless possibilities, so why not use a hula hoop? For <laughs> killing zombies. Yep, exactly. So, if we talk a little bit about the projects that your company has done, uh, can you tell us more about uh, customer cases or such that you would like to share with us? In augmented reality, our biggest thing right now is our arena platform, where you can build your own augmented reality experiences. Um, you can add different 3D models, uh, green screen video, video, um, text, photos, uh, questions, whatever you like. And um, it will also automatically 
appear on your mobile phone in the right location. So it uses your phone's GPS signal, and when you're in the right location, it shows you the AR experience that you built using our VR, uh, or sorry, using our web browser editor. So that's, that's the thing we've been working on in, in augmented reality. And actually, as of late, we, we built this AR game called Save Turku, Elasta Turku AR game. We made, made the game for the city of Turku. And, and in, the, uh, in the game, you, you have to solve these different puzzle, puzzles and, uh, uh, and uh, solve these different things in order to advance and see the full story. It's an interactive AR game that uses both in, uh, in real life elements and uh, AR elements. It combines different worlds. And, and uh, we've been uh, receiving a lot of great feedback about the game. And it actually uses our Tarina platform. Uh, you, can, you can like modify and build these experiences by yourself. Our latest AR project was done to Urheilu Museo, the sports museum of Finland. And uh, they had this idea that they wanted to bring real, real athletes into their AR application. And uh, we wanted to make that into a real reality. And we did it by using green screen technology. So first we uh, photographed or filmed these athletes and then brought them to the application. And it, enhances the whole visiting experience, the uh, Urheilu Museo AR application. So when you visit the sports museum, uh, you can use the application and get like um, more details about, about exhibition pieces and uh, your surroundings. And I, I think it's a really nice way of, uh, of, uh, of visiting and uh, of experiencing a museum. We've done a lot of VR training softwares. Uh, one of our biggest things that we've done this year is, is a VR software for Novia and Abu Amare. We made this VR extension for their physical ship bridge simulator. They have this ship, uh, ship bridge simulator that they use for training different sea, seafaring things. For example, if they lose a steering, uh, if they lose a steering in a boat, they might like practice something on their physical physical ship bridge simulator. So we've made a, a VR extension for the simulator so they can uh, practice even more and uh, different scenarios that they probably couldn't couldn't practice before or train before. So that's been really fun. Uh... Okay, I mean the steering move now. We don't have our rudder controls here on the bridge. Radar starboard, could you please check our situation? Please, radar starboard 5. Midships. Midships. Keeping steady. Recently, we actually made a VR training software for Linde um, for their gas truck drivers or gas truck tanker drivers. Um, in, in the software, they will learn about uh, loading and unloading of liquid nitrogen. And of course, uh, in, the, in the real world, uh, this is pretty dangerous. But in virtual reality, you can, you can uh, train these these different uh, processes in a safe and immersive manner, so you won't won't get hurt. And of course, it frees up the gas tanker truck for different purposes as well. So it saves time and uh, resources. So why are you as a company working with VR and AR? 
because we're good at it. Well, we got our start in the University of Turku. Uh, and there actually we, we researched why, or we wanted to find out if, if AR and VR are a good method of, of learning and uh, if they could be used in education. And we quickly found out that they can, can be used in edu education and in learning and in teaching. And in fact, they are a really, really effective method of learning. Um, research suggests that actually the memory retention is a lot higher after after an VR experience compared to text-based text -based or uh, video-based based, uh, learning material. So in that sense, VR is a really effective way of learning. So after that, we note that we really made money out of this, or we, we can make a business out of this. So, uh, uh, 2017, we founded this company, and we haven't looked back ever since. So, I think our expertise and our roots are in the university world. So, we are very knowledgeable and very skillful as a company. And I think the people are our biggest asset. And what do you think is the most exciting thing about working with XR? Limitless possibilities. I mean, you can you can make anything into the into a real reality. You can make the impossible possible, and that's that's the thing I really enjoy about XR. You've made a project. You you finished this huge thing, and then you get to present present the project to, to the client. And seeing the face of the client when he actually realizes or she realizes that, wow, this can be done. This can be actually beneficial for me. Uh, and the wow factor and everything, that's priceless in my opinion. What do you think are the challenges when working with XR? Well, I think people still have a lot of misconceptions and doubts about virtual reality, for example. Uh, people always think that they, they will feel ill or VR is super expensive or, or super complicated, but that couldn't be further from the truth, actually. VR can be even pretty inexpensive. Um, it's not very complicated at all. You just put on the goggles and, and have fun like I'm having right now. Or, and, uh, well, some people might get ill, but Usually, like in a setting like this, it's really rare, and in my opinion, doesn't even happen. But uh, people have these misconceptions, and you just have to clarify them, and uh, it's fine. Yep. And then let's go on to something a bit fun. Uh, if you could collaborate on a project with anyone in the world, any company, who would you want to collaborate with? Anyone who's willing to coll collaborate. <laughs> Well, I, I really don't know. Like, like I'd say that every client is as important as the next one or the last one. Um, our clients are very important to us, and I don't have a dream project per se. But as a sports person, I'd like to do something related to sports, maybe like like a huge AR project within a sports stadium or a arena or or a VR experience for, for a sports club, whatever, but maybe something along along those lines. So keep it in mind, it might be you. And then how do you see the future of this industry? I see it definitely growing. I think people, because of COVID and because of the pandemic, uh, people being forced to use new technologies. Um, they've been forced to try out different things, Teams and Skype and whatever. Even those who never used used like these remote collaboration tools before, they've been forced to use them. And I think VR is the next technology in line, the next technology that will break through. And naturally, we want to be part of it. And hopefully will be part of it. And why should MatchXR visitors visit your space? What is there to see? 
Well, <laughs> not much to be honest, <laughs> but we have something here. Like, like I previously mentioned, we have this AR figures right there and uh, some VR training software presentations on the corner right there. But if you want to talk to us, if you want to learn more about VR and AR and uh, different possibilities, that would be a thing to come and visit, I'd say. So you are going to be here during Match XR? Yes, definitely. Awesome. Uh, and where else can we find your company on social media and such? I'd encourage people to go to go to our LinkedIn profile. We try to post something every week and uh, yeah, follow us in LinkedIn. <laughs> yep, control reality on LinkedIn. Yes. Awesome. Well, thank you so much. It's been such a pleasure having you, and I hope you have a great time at MatchXR too. Thank you. Thank you for having, having me. Well, thank you, and we'll see you in the later programs. Thank you.